Hi, today I want to present a set of strings by Pirastro. The name is Eva Pirazzi Slap. One fun fact about these strings, I mean, I just read this story on the internet, is that they're called Eva Pirazzi Slap, but they are not really uh, only restricted to be used to, to slap playing, not at all. And uh, because of this name, many people go around these strings they don't even consider them because they think okay that's for slappers that's a big mistake and for this reason some shops uh, offer these strings and call them uh, eva pirazzi uh, gold because the the package look like gold for these strings pirastro has worked together with the french bass player nicolas duboucher his wish was to have plain gut strings for g and d and then synthetic strings for A and E. So they developed this set of strings and for the, the synthetic E and A, they took as a basis the Eva Pirazzi recipe, let's say, and changed it a little bit to have it more sounding like a gut string. After a while, they came up with the idea that they could also make the D and G string in that way, so you would have a complete synthetic set which would sound quite like a gut string so this is what i have now on this bass this is the eva pirazzi slap with the synthetic d and g the big question is what is the special thing about the sound of a gut string the one thing is the punch gut strings normally have a really nice punch at the beginning of the tone and after this this attack punch the decay is quite fast so you don't have too much sustain magic all of a sudden i have the gut strings on g and d i love the attack of gut strings the second thing about gut strings is their timbre their their actual sound now the sound of a gut string, you might say it is kind of less bright than uh, the sound of a metal string. That's true, but somehow it's not only a, a, a dull kind of sound. There are also some really nice high frequencies in the sound, some kind of silky, mellow high frequencies, which you really don't get with a metal string. So in one way, yes, they are less bright, but they are not dull. So this is really a, a challenge, how to get this kind of a tone uh, without using gut. If you, if you take a metal string and you dampen it, at some point you would get something like a classical string. So here you have a real challenge. You have to dampen the string in a way that it doesn't sound too dead. You want to have less sustain and more punch at the beginning but still some kind of a clearness and some nice high frequencies. With this set, Pirastro got this problem really well balanced and I will show you now what they sound like. Now I will show you the same kind of bass line with the G and D gut strings. maybe a little bit of a groove with a synthetic evaporatsy slap. Now grooving on the gut.
some solo. Soloing on the guts. Now a little bit of slapping. I'm not a slapper, but I will try. Now a little bit of arco. Many of us dream of a string that combines the advantages of gut strings and those of metal strings. So the comfortability and the tuning stability of a metal string, the flat wound wrapping, but also the punch and the warmth of a, a gut string. This is a, a good possibility. <laughs> And it, it is quite close to the olive string, which is also by Pirastro. I have olives on my other bass. It's a bigger bass, so it's not a really fair comparison, but still you can get it here. course the, the tone is a little bit bigger because the bass is also bigger but uh, there is some similarity actually the olive string is even a little bit brighter and has a little bit more sustain which is really interesting so the big question with this mixed set is how does the plain gut fit with the synthetic how is uh, when you go from one to the other what does this sound like I will try to show you this now So I hope you liked this presentation. Please let me know what you think about these strings. And if you have any suggestion uh, about what you would like me to, to show you when I do this, just let me know. And please, please, I need a couple more subscriptions. So please subscribe.
that was it for today. Bye-bye.